Hey, and welcome to this tutorial. Today we will cover Myers Bonus Bound and Box Scale Tool. Follow the tutorial linked in the description to easily install the bonus tools from Maya. You might have noticed that once you've frozen the transforms, it can be difficult to scale an object to a specific size. So this is a very useful tool to do just that. Here we have an object and we don't know the size of this object, as if you look at the attributes, you can see the scale is set to one. But if we look at the grid, we can see this object is larger than one unit of size. So what we can do is head up to bonus tools, modify, bound and box scale tool. And we have a couple of options. So we can set the pivot position. I will just set this to the bottom of the bound and box on the Y axis. And once we've done that, we can adjust the scale with the inputs here at the top. It would be nice if all these values were linked for a uniform scale, but they're not. And what these values actually represent is the size of the bound and box wrapped around this object. So say for some reason we wanted this object to only be one meter on the Y axis. We can just type that here. And now based on the bound and box, we have squished the mesh on the Y axis to exactly one meter of units or whatever your Maya scene is set to. Currently, as I said, this is squished. So we can now copy the scale value to keep everything uniform. So just like this onto the X and Z. And doing that, you can now see that it has been scaled proportionally. Of course, you could force the mesh into whatever scale of bound and box you wanted. This is a great way to scale objects you don't necessarily have the transform history for, but you do know the dimensions you want it to be. Be sure to join the Discord server to chat with a great community of fellow modelers and check out my Patreon for access to the members only chat and a whole bunch of assets and tools. Thanks for watching. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you did, hit the like and subscribe buttons. Come chat with me on the Discord and I'll see you in the next video.